So I'm doing all the work, I guess. Oops. It's a Polaroid. Let me see. I think it still works. Come here. Yeah, you. Smile, well, right? Why would you do that? Does it not have film? Don't lose it. Oh, there comes the color. It's a nice picture. You need to throw that thing away, though. <laughs> right? Okay. Up here. Who? Hey, don't fall. Oh, I well, can't get through here. What are you doing? Yeah, I can't get through the dog. So what's the solution here? Is he gonna catch it? Ah, okay. I'll just go over it. Come on, Nate. Is that a fire alarm? Looks like a fire alarm. There. I'll see you on the other side. Okay. It's a good thing I'm not claustrophobic. Is it this way? Nope. Not this way. This way. This way. That was dumb. Oh yeah. More medication, okay. more medical equipment. I'm in. Can you get the door open? Ah, it's locked from this side too. Got to find a key. Look around. Is there a key nearby? This this <sighs> coding. This was for That's painkillers. For Edmund, I guess. Was Edmund like their brother? Oh, come on. Evelyn, I was hoping I wouldn't have to write this letter. I was hoping our last conversation made my intentions clear. I was hoping that ignoring our repeated attempts to your repeated attempts to contact me would eventually send the right message. Discovering you sent my daughter a check in the mail means the means the message was too subtle for someone like you. I don't need your money, and more to the point, I don't want your money. I can take care of my family just fine without your help. It's insulting to both of our intelligence to pretend that that, I, that your hollow gesture would somehow rekindle our relationship. Ah, okay. What little was left of our bond died the moment you couldn't bother to show up for Dad's funeral. Huh? Right up to the moment he drew his last breath, he still loved you. I don't. I pray you find peace with whatever it is you've been seeking your entire life, but do not contact me or my family again. What? Evelyn. Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's sad. What? What's... Maybe... Maybe... What? I'm confused. Okay. Oh, that's... Yeah, it is. God. Got it. Yeah, I think she had another family. Oh, this is tragic, man. So, anything? Didn't see any journals. Right, well, 
We still got the other locked door, so come on. Will the same key work? Yep. Nope. Use it. Going Never on. stops, man. Well, let's see what we find. Is it just here? Nope. It's our Peter the Great and the something. The Amber Room. Uh huh. Viking no. Treasures of Inland. Another box here. This should be it. Wow. <laughs> Cassandra M. Cassandra M. Sam. You got something? Oh, was Cassandra their mother? So I'm totally off. So who's Evelyn? This is it. <laughs> what? Which is a paradise? Evelyn bought a first edition of general history of Paris from a collector along with a stack of 18th century documents. Among them I found a, an intriguing letter from one Joseph Burns, who not only admits to being a crewman on Harry, Henry Avery's ship, but possibly hints at Avery's vast treasure. What else could riches of paradise refer to? If he sent this letter from prison, he clearly didn't have the treasure with him, so where is it? I need to trace it back to the source, Henry Avery's attack on, on the gunsway. Picture caption, Joseph Burns. Map caption, last known sighting. Note above, above letter. What are these markings? Yeah, Madagascar. Whoa. Henry Avery. Guns away heist. Oh, what do you got there? I've never seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that, you know, that's definitely Mom's handwriting. Put up your hands. Slowly. Hey, hey, hey. There's no need for that. Who are you? What is he are you do? Evelyn? Hey, you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. Your journal. All right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. Ex please explain. So what now? Now, we wait. <sighs> For the police. For the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... <laughs> just ex I really don't want to shoot you. R just explain the... the there was no harm. No foul. Just explain right. that Cassandra was your mother. We all must face the consequences for our actions. Hm. You're Evelyn, though, aren't you? At least I don't I get know. it. I don't get it. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, the, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Morgan? Uh, That's a paradise name. Hi. I can't. <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah, you're still nice, so, uh, do you mind? <sighs> yeah, yeah. You're coughing, so. Just. Pull up a cigarette. You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. Yeah? yeah that's sort of an understatement. So. Who are you? Almost like your translator? Your 
mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. His eyes lit up. That's that was beautiful. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Happened a long time ago. So who's the you're? So you're Evelyn, friends. right? I, I don't get it. This would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Okay. But she still called the police, right? Learning that old pirate secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. <laughs> Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. The acting is magnificent, though. Yeah. Are we still gonna have to escape from the police? It's as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Yeah, so, uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out. Hmm? Yeah. Uh, Such a nice old lady. <sighs> Thank you. I'm sorry about the mess. <laughs> it was already messy. Oh, that's bad. Are you okay? Oh, that's bad. Oh, this is bad. Holy shit. Hey. 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 Stan? Oh, this is really bad. Oh, you can't talk Wait, yourself out of this. Something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. You just leave her here? There's nothing we can do for her. All right, we have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Ma'am? Nathan! We gotta go. Right now. Oh, shit. Window! Window! Come on! I think I can make this jump. Crap. This is really loud. Dude, just do it. Sam, I got you. Just jump. That was really dangerous, Sam. Shouldn't have done that. The chimney. Come on. Come uh, hope. Why so many cops? Why so many cops? Too many. The front gate looks clear. Front gate. Got it. Okay. Oh. 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 That was loud. You there, don't move. Run for it. Don't shoot their children. Don't shoot. This way. We can lose them. We've got two Okay. Adults? That's uh, it's a stretch. Um
Um. Okay. Let's keep going. Run. Stop, God damn it. Up the stairs. To the left. Run. Shit. They're both eggs. Um. Dumpster. Come on. Okay. Who? <gasps> Sam. Taking me back to the to the orphanage, really? Is this New York? I don't know. It's just a bridge. I just associate bridges with New York. Could be Chicago, actually. I'd say we're clear. But we catch our breath for a second. I don't actually know if Chicago has any bridges. Hmm. Some night, huh? Some night. That old lady. Hey. And you listen to me. That wasn't our fault back then. It wasn't. But and still. Lady, she, yeah. She was um sick. It's okay to feel bad, but there was nothing we could do about it. The Morgan boys. What are we gonna do now? Hmm. I so, can't go back so, to the orphanage. So they are Drake's we heirs. Can't go back to your job. Why not? Then we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Oh, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, yeah. That's us. What if it wasn't? Nathan, back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Yeah. Here. I always felt that we were destined for something great. But until tonight... Greatness from small beginnings, man. I didn't know what that meant. This. Mom's unfinished work. This is our chance to restart our lives with brand new identities. What are you talking about? Well, I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name, Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Doesn't mean you were. Who's to say he didn't? You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise you and me together, we're gonna go far. <laughs> so what do you say? Nathan Drake? Theme, now, theme. Everything changed after that. We became is this the explorers. is this the first time you're telling your wife this story? Mostly thieves. Ow. Okay, just hold still. You know, for a while, it felt like you know, if we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. <laughs> and you know, after I lost him, I, after I thought I lost him. She's such a good wife, though. You didn't want to bring him back up again. Something okay. Like that. That's just my question. That's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. But... It's a lot. Doesn't excuse it though. I'd love to know what you're thinking. She doesn't know what she's thinking. I'm thinking, thinking that you're lucky that I found you when I did. Why are you here though? Yeah. 
Oh god, they Thank love god each other so much. It would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> no, I mean, how did you get here? Uh, of course. Of course. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Hey, darling. How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive. Par for the course. Now we just need to rescue the other Drake. What do you mean? I'll let Nate tell you. Yeah. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. I wasn't missing. So what happened to Sam? Rafe's got him. Shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah, they're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place New to set Devon. down. Once we get Sam, we're going to need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey, what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar. No, there is no Alcazar. Yeah. It's all bullshit. Wait, you mean the dip, the the escape? Yeah. Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? <laughs> Look, I'll fill you in on everything when I see you. Okay? Yeah, I can't wait. Look, you two be safe down there. You know us. Yep. JJ. Thanks. Sure. Oh, Thank she's you. still mad. She's still mad. Thanks for saving me. And she should be mad. Again. I almost didn't this time. Come on. I got us a ride. This doesn't mean everything's fine. <laughs>